and his position of life. We are simply becoming more and more attached and carrying too much with us. Our gadgets, our tricky and very limited identity we took on. We want to prove to others that we are more important than their significant existence here. With this extremely convoluted and uneducated, unintelligent approach to life, we created money, we created poverty, we created politics, we created division, we created the most absurd way to learn and know and live the life that is meant to be a profound experience here on earth, yet that profoundness has been completely scotched by the very education you receive. Every creature, regardless, is intelligent to exist in a phenomenal way, a survival and a phenomenal experience of life. It's not the the toughest or the strongest that survives. It's the intelligence to exist here without being tangled by your psychological drama is what is key to the profoundness and the exuberant and the brilliance and the reverberation of the life within and life, how you exchange and relate to the environment, a given environment, regardless of the chosen in your mind. If you're not playing with the very thought and emotions and the mind, your journey on this planet the environment you relate to, the existence that we see as, the life around us will simply be integrated as part of this enormous reality and experience of life. And that said, I will continue my journey of this morning in the mist the fog, the cold, the, the, the drizzle, the, the sharpness of that water hitting my face and the life that's waking up to another dawn, another day from darkness to this light is going to propel me into experience something that you won't be unless you're involved in life the way and the how it is.